and cross your legs for me. That's it. So give my fingers a really good squeeze. That's right. Now try and push me away. We're fundamentally trying to make some really significant changes to health and social care in Derbyshire. Are you all right? Just kicking off with that then? We are trying to work together. We're trying to look at how we can collaborate more within Derbyshire and what that means uh, in order to provide services for the patients across Derbyshire. Okay, we so felt that just by writing a plan and okay. saying that's what we wanted to do, that wasn't going to make that difference. And that's where we felt that an OD plan could help us to do that. Working together requires more than just changing procedures and pathways. So the OD element was very much around how do we start bringing the STP together to work as a more collaborative unit. And then put your hands back like this. Working across boundaries has um, opened up a lot of doors and shown us that actually we can make a difference and we can make this simpler if we just simply talk about it and work out of a simple way to do things. We'd run a bespoke development programme for the Wellbeing Erewash Vanguard in 2016 and that brought together a whole range of people from CCGs, from provider trusts, general practice and social care and by giving them some protected time and space to have different conversations there was a whole different dynamic to the way they worked together so it just felt obvious to try and offer the same thing to the eight place alliances. What we did in Erewash is we recognised and we had a very clear picture that it was not just about health and the NHS and that's why it worked so well because then we started to get this bigger picture. From a health point of view what we're really looking at is to bring those pathways together so when we look at frailty for instance we want people to be doing the same pathway rather than the hospital have one pathway and the community service have another. The team that I am working for is a holistic team in central Chesterfield um, and it's about looking at what we can do for old frail people and how we can give them the care that they need and can we deliver that care here in their own homes. The challenges we've faced actually have been communication um, regarding systems so um, one GP system doesn't talk to another GP system or um, one service doesn't talk to another service so trying to get all that information that you might need yes. as part of your assessment is quite difficult. What are you knitting today? but also the referrals on can be quite um, problematic. I think the reason that developing the place alliances lends itself to an OD project is because we're asking people to do something fundamentally different to what they've done before. We're asking them to change the way in which they deliver care, the way in which they organise themselves and their people. So this was the stuff that she felt joined up care Derbyshire needs to do, better understanding of, of what place alliances are What we've are got in Derbyshire are eight places and, um, and what we've got right? are four cohorts, so there's two places in each cohort. They, last two days they will then work months. together and apply some of the tools that they're learning. Purpose. This gives it an added depth and that's hopefully and intentionally the, the sustainability element of it. It's back to that trust element and when you leave this room do you know it's going to happen or do you walk back into your organisations and your silos rather than think, hang on a minute, we've said we're going to work together as a place alliance on this. As part of um, the frailty unit where I used to work at Chesterfield Royal, um, we looked at how could we um, help to keep these people within their own homes rather than being in hospital. So the multidisciplinary team is composed of a community frailty GP, um, myself and another advanced nurse practitioner, a community matron, we have um, an occupational therapist um, who uh, sits alongside the physiotherapy team and we also have a care coordinator. It was always going to be that the multidisciplinary team was the way that we were going to be able to make this frailty team work. I think the course has benefited me greatly. The relationship building has been, um, has been a real benefit. But I don't think the holistic team would have worked as quickly if we hadn't been on the OD programme. I feel that that has made a big change because we've met senior managers and frontline staff who've been able to engage with us and um, cross those boundaries as we've needed to and drive this forward. Can you lift this leg? The impact I've noticed um, this, this programme have is that it's helping to shift the locus of influence 
away from the existing way of doing things and more towards the place alliances. And that's really important because if we're trying to do something fundamentally different, if we can't carry on doing the things we've always done, we're going to get what we've always had. And I think this is helping us to have a different conversation and to approach things in a different way.